kind of bright. It's really bright. Okay. I'm Roger. Ali. We're building a boat because it's just time to build a boat. Cross the things off my bucket list. She wants to go sailing. So we're building a boat. We're building an 11 foot long, almost 12 foot long sailboat, rowboat called the Scamp. That light is pretty bright. It is real bright. We don't have anything else to say about it other than we just built the jig. We put the, we scarfed up hull planks and tomorrow we sand more sanding everything yeah. a lot of sanding a lot of prepping a lot of sanding and more prepping and sanding, and then more epoxy in. so i don't think we're going to be building anything for another few days sanding and epoxy in. we got mccallum so we're good to go yeah yeah more yeah <laughs> we're good to go day two What'd you put down?
I've been building or working on it for the past three weeks with my daughter Allison, who's not here right now. She's working, um, and we've spent the first two weeks, almost three weeks, uh, stiffening the four mil and five mil, uh, six mil plywood. Uh, with uh, epoxy coats, uh, clear coats of epoxy uh, to make them a little more rigid when they go into the sailboat. It's also part of the waterproofing process. Just the insides, not the outsides. Uh, we've done the uh, frames or bulkheads. Um, we've done the, the centerboard case, uh, which I'll be doing the centerboard case fiberglassing today, um, but I've been We've, we've clear coated the outsides, not the inside, but the outside of the uh, fiber of the uh, centerboard case. Um, and the inside of the hull planks. And that's been kind of a long process because it's uh, kind of cold outside. It's been uh, 30 to 35. We've had to keep it about 55, 60 in the shop, uh, which has made the slow curing epoxy uh, take a little longer, almost uh, eight to ten hours to uh, cure. So it's been kind of slow going. Plus, we've lost power a couple of damn times, and uh, the temperature went down to the teens there for a couple of days. So it was kind of tough to keep it about 50 degrees in the shop. So uh, it's been kind of, kind of cool, kind of long, uh, but it's been kind of cool. So we're at the phase now where I'm going to fiberglass the inside of the uh, centerboard trunk and. Then I'm going to start the sanding process um, probably tomorrow. I'll be doing clips along the way, so I'll add the clips to this video. Uh, in the meantime, I'll try to shut up because I know a lot of people don't like the talking. So we won't talk too much today um, or anytime for that matter. So enjoy it.